<laughs> Welcome to Buddy. What? <laughs> that was a nice intro. What? That was great. Uh, this week we got Rodrigo. Rodrigo. Hello. Sid Hello. from Newgrounds. Yeah. And, and a person. It, 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 tell us, it's for the people at home that might not know you, please oh, wow. tell us what you did Man. and do. Where do I even start? Uh, I've done a lot of stuff on Newgrounds. Uh, I did stuff on the El Cid channel you can check out. It's funny, I got a lot of cartoons that are like, like, kind of all over the place, but I think people don't connect the dots because mm-hmm. I did like Batman Eats a Hot Dog and mm-hmm. King of the Mon Hill <laughs> and then Glarfieldiator. Mm-hmm. Those are all the big internet hits. But like the oldest hit was uh, Mega Man vs. Quick Man. Which oh, was, like, I remember that. We were just talking about that, that beforehand. That's, that's yeah. old school, but yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. That's, uh, that's, some, that's some real like classic stuff. And I, I I, and I, I'm actually, I quote, uh, I'm okay, Dad. I quote that a lot. <laughs> fucking everyone does. Yeah, I fucking I'm love okay, it. Dad. I'm okay, Dad. You know, what's funny is uh, that was, uh, I was recording that with Hans, mm. and we were both just kind of like, all right, who's going to do whose voice? We don't even know. He really wanted to do Hanks. And I was like, well, how do we get Bobby? That's going to be impossible because in the real show, it's a woman doing it. So I was like, I'll give it a shot. And, of course, record it, then we pitch it up a little bit. And we hit the first time we pitched it up, it was perfect. And we were just on the ground <laughs> laughing. We were like, just destroyed. Wait, us. so you're Bobby? Yeah. I thought that was Hans. Yeah, I know. Wow. That's I'm okay, great. Dad. But I'm okay, Dad. Of course, Dad. with some, some help from uh, audition. That's amazing. <laughs> okay, well, well, speaking of which, we're going to draw King of Hell. Oh, yeah. King of Hell. Oh, Rod's actually, request. Uh, that's right. I love me some Mike Judge. Don't we? All right. So uh, with with King of the Hill, who are we going to draw first for the kings? I mean, should we do the the obvious choice? Well, the, we we the generally main guy? we generally do the main guy last. We oh, build okay, up to okay. it. <laughs> so uh, I'm trying to think. We can do Bobby. Bobby. Hmm. Bobby's good. I like Bobby. Okay. Let's do Bobby. Okay. Okay. Okay, Ross. So Rod. Yeah. Yeah, Chris. <laughs> Who's the wife? Oh, quite pregnant. <laughs> oh, <laughs> once again. Shit. No, uh, my girlfriend's good. <laughs> to answer your question. She's okay. She's okay, Chris. <laughs> I don't have any fucking reference for this fat idiot. I'm going Oh, what happened to I'm not going to use reference, Chris? I'm so... Okay. No, dude, I'm, Chris, I'm not using reference either. Okay, let's, just, f- let's go fucking crazy. <laughs> what? You're not shit. I am. Fuck. <laughs> right. Be a loser. See if I care, Ross. This is exactly how, nice to me. how Bobby looks. Oh, the way I'm doing it. Fucking, I know he's got. I got one of these new stands. Oh, I love. Oh my god, I got a reference image up of the uh, the episode where he had to smoke all those cigarettes. <laughs> I love that episode so much. I'm gonna watch you smoke every last damn one of these. That's you know that really happened, like to Mike Judge or one of his friends. Like, uh, it just feel it feels so real. My my friend uh, my friend back home, Cameron. Uh, he uh, he got court caught court. He got caught with a ton of pornography on his computer. Uh-oh. That bastard. And his uh, what's his, wrong with him? What's wrong with him? He's like he has a sex drive or something. <laughs> he might have been like really young at the time, but uh, his dad like fucking made him watch like oh, no. all the porn with oh, him. No. <laughs> <laughs> he like sat down with him and was just like. Son, I'm gonna make you hate pornography. <laughs> We're gonna watch this together. That sounds like a sick fucking That's, creep. I don't know if that really fixes things. No, in fact, I just imagine that would just fuck with your sexuality for the rest of your yeah. life. Yeah, yeah, because you're getting kind of hot and bothered and your dad's right next to you. That, you I don't know if that's healthy. That's, you'd start having nightmares of you watching porn and then all of a sudden your dad putting your hand on your shoulder and just being like, <laughs> just nodding. <laughs> does Bobby, oh, he does. He wears like little fucking... Like slipper shoe things. Slippers? Does he really? You know, no, you know those shoes that you slip on is what I mean. They, oh, like. Do they got laces? I don't. Does I forget? I don't like know. the just flip flops? No, he doesn't wear flip flops. He wears crop top. Oh, okay. Well, he does. Just put him in a crop top. <laughs> mm. Okay. Okay, okay Dad. Dad. <laughs> Sorry oh. if we quote that too oh, no, much while you're it's, here. That's much appreciated. Hearing hearing uh, real life. Thumbs up is better than YouTube comments being, you know. <laughs> oh, I know. You know how it is. <laughs> what, what is your favorite King of the Hill episode? Oh, man. 
Uh, I like Duran Rockers. Uh, Which King one's that? The, the the YouTube poop guy. <laughs> oh yeah, <laughs> better I was than the talk- show. He's he's incredible. I think I was uh, I was watching that with uh, Amber when she was still here. Like we were, we were talking about YouTube poops, and she brought up that, and I was like, oh, I've seen this before. This is really good. Yeah, there's mm. an art to that stuff. And it's like really well edited. Yeah, and they come up with their own weird like storylines. They get so into this weird YouTube poop mythology that they make. <laughs> <laughs> it's incredible. Um, yeah, they like aspire there's, to be that, you know. It's amazing when they'll actually do their own lip sync and stuff for like a YouTube poop, and just like, whoa. Have you seen the Master Pooper or whatever his name is? The Master Pooper. Master he Pooper. Just poops of Harry Potter and the Prisoner of Azkaban. <laughs> just specifically the, that movie. Well, you know, he's done a lot of stuff, but he they're really well edited, and he like, he's really good at lighting and stuff. I'd say check him out. Master Pooper. Mm. Can you monet- you can't monetize that stuff now, can you? I don't think so. I think you ever could. Oh no? I don't, I don't think you can monetize poops. Man. Yeah, I don't think anything. Well, actually, that's maybe. I mean, maybe you can. nothing. It's, sacred. it's under fair use, but you'll still get flagged. In yeah, because it. it's because you you have stuff from like Fox and stuff in it. There's no real way to like, fight even that. Even if you you're, if you're under fair use, they'll still find a way to flag you. I had a dream once that if I ever was a billionaire, I would produce a regular daytime sitcom. And just film it like you would, you know, Big Bang Theory or whatever. Just the whole, like, process. And then I would get, like, Dram Rocker and fucking Dykeike and all those guys to just take all the footage and interpret it how they want. (laughs) And that would be the only existing version of that, like, anywhere. I, uh, it's like, what the hell is this? I'm like, this is it. This is the final. This is it. <laughs> I want to, when and if my show ever comes out, which I hope to God it does. Yeah, yeah. Uh, it won't. <laughs> it won't. Ha <laughs> <laughs> ha. Um, I want to release a, uh, a Pirate Bay version of it okay. that's just like completely fucking wrong. Like, uh, uh, what do you call it? There's my favorite thing ever that was ever done on the Pirate Bay was that when Toy Story 3 came out, Apparently there was a version circulating that you know you know the end where they, I've told this story before but you know the end where they go through the uh, um, they're in the in, incinerator it's, oh no yeah yeah it yeah. literally just it, as as they all hold hands it cuts to black and plays the credits with no <laughs> that's, music that's and that version was going around that's on the perfect. internet for a while and I'm just like that is the funniest most evil shit okay I'm done I'm done I think, I think I'm in a pretty good spot but here we go. Show me your Bobby. I'm okay, <laughs> <laughs> He smoked uh, a bunch of cigarettes. Super high Bobby. Yeah. I'll show you guys mine. It's not special. He's got high off tobacco. He's just getting married. <laughs> what? I like his little face. Connie, <laughs> let's get married. <laughs> He's going to marry Peggy. Peggy? Show me yours. All right, so I made Slug Bobby because I... Really <laughs> <laughs> I, really I love him. <laughs> Why? You gave him, like, a real face. <laughs> what if he was real but also a slug? And a girl. <laughs> this is from the the episodes they never made. I like they it. They wrote these out. <laughs> so, okay, who's next? Uh, the, 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 mm, oh, uh, how about... Uh, uh, Rusty Shackleford. I love that guy. Oh, he's great. Wait, who? Mike Judge voices him. What are you talking about? Dale Gruel. Rusty Shackleford? Shackleford. It's his, it's his alias. What about John Redcorn? Remember every time he's just like... He's like, if anyone was, if anyone asked who was here, tell them it was Rusty Shackleford. <laughs> oh. It's like the, the name he always goes by. Okay, I, I, I haven't binged them, so I'm definitely missing a do you few know, okay. Do you know John Redcorn? Yeah. You guys want to try that? Uh, I like that guy. He's the guy with the, the fair going on, right? Yeah, yeah. I, I like the episode where they insinuated he was a cannibal. <laughs> I love that his kid's so blatantly his kid. What are you talking about? The, exactly. yeah. My son. My son. I can't do good King of the Hill I love, impressions. I love that, uh, the episode where uh, they they call it, like, Thanks Killing or whatever. And then um, <laughs> he, like, go, he makes a traditional, like, Indian Thanksgiving uh Dinner, but it's um it's a bunch of human body parts, and he's like back in the he's like back then they, they ate people, and he's like what? And then everyone turns to him like you oh, ate yeah. people. I remember that one. Yeah, and then his son is just like you're disgusting. Yeah, and he runs away. Yeah, <laughs> it's the funniest shit. <laughs> Why did I do wrong? Why did I do wrong? That's, I don't think he says that even. I'm just know. being an idiot. I don't even remember what he looks like. I'm just. He's, he's just like a handsome... He's like a handsome Native American man. Yeah. I'm just drawing a weird corpse man. <laughs> I'm sorry. I'll, I'll draw John Jekyll fuck next to him. Chris! What? Stay on topic. 
Wait, uh, are we doing Dale or are we doing... We're, we're oh. doing Red Porn. We're do- red Corn. Red, oh, okay, okay. Red Boy. I'm good either way. <laughs> what is Red Corn? The, is that a thing? That's his Native American name. I know, but was there ever Red Corn at any point? I think there was. We'll leave a comment it was, below. Yeah, before it was cultivated. Were really? It was like brown and black and just weird colors. Brown? Was, weren't, like, <laughs> weren't like bananas and shit like really weird too? Like if you look at like fruit as it used to be. Yeah, prehistoric bananas had like fangs. And like fur, <laughs> fur. <laughs> they ran around like <laughs> chimps. Yeah. They were actually part of the primate family before they lost the battle. Right, right. then they became like the, the number one the, food source. Prey. <laughs> hey, how about you fucking shrink like I ask you to, stupid? What is that? What you say to your 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 fucking shrink? Your, your member? <laughs> shrink. Yeah. Don't get excited right now. I'm trying to like decrease the size. There we go. Cause he was taking up too much space. Chris is talking about his penis. He has it out right now. He's, yeah, it's he's, taking he's, up too he's much. He's yelling space. at it. It's taking up too much space. <laughs> it's just kind of a typical Wednesday. Yeah, Wednesday Adams, dude. He has the opposite of a problem, an, like an erectile dysfunction. He's an erectile hyperfunction. Yes. <laughs> Super functioning. I showed uh, um, some visitors to the Game Grumps office, uh, babe. Yeah. And it was it was received very well. <laughs> Who did you show? Uh, it was because uh, Susie was filming with Sky Williams oh. and his uh, his roomies were just bored and hanging out. And I was like, "Do you want to see a funny?" Because they were talking about cringe videos, and I was like, Are "I you got fucking serious? yeah." And I was just like, "I got some good shit." And there's like Chris showed me this, and they watched. I said they, they were like pitches to it, pitch it to us, and I said, um, "There's a line in the movie that literally says, babe." We're in Minecraft, <laughs> and they're like, "We're in," and then we wa- they watched it, and they're like. Oh boy. <laughs> it's the best video I've ever seen. So Rod, I, I, like years and years ago, a guy uploaded a video. Are we putting this in the episode? Um, I don't know. Yeah, I feel like you could because you're not saying where to find it. Yeah, I'm just... Basically. Oh wait, no, you told me about this. And you, you, and then you ended up saving it to your hard drive and now it's like your little treasure. Yeah, so, yeah, <laughs> so this guy uploaded this video that was like, he brings his girlfriend to Minecraft. And it's like the it's like the best video ever made. It's it's incredible. It's incredible. Yeah, it's and, so good. I'm like <laughs> mad that it's not on the internet. And yeah, so <laughs> he, he uploaded it and took it down like instantly. But I saved it right before he took it down because I was like, this, this is the best thing I've ever seen. I saved it and then he took it down. And I was like, yes, right. <laughs> and I put it on a hard drive and then I moved away and I lost the hard drive for like three or four years. <laughs> and then last week I found it and I was like, yes. <laughs> and I, and I brought it over and showed Ross. Oh my God, we had a screening. Yeah. Like we were playing, dun- <laughs> we were playing Dungeons and Dragons at like uh, for Holly's birthday because we have a D and D group, and Chris came to join for the first time. Uh-huh. And uh, we took like a thirty minute break just to like <laughs> enjoy some cringe video. <laughs> the finest selection. It of is cringe. literally the. F- it's not. It's not cringy to me. It's just really funny. <laughs> it's like a laughing riot from it's, start to finish. It's actually like pretty well produced. <laughs> like he has some pretty decent green screen effects, which yeah. are kind of surprising. I was just telling Chris the other day, like I think it's hilarious that what was it like that Valentine guy on Second Life? Oh, Genesis Valentine. Before I understood what that was, I just heard that song that you put together, and I was like, wow, this is beautiful. And and it, I think in the description you're like, oh, this is based off of <laughs> fucking this. I'm like, okay, and I click on that, and I'm like. <laughs> What? <laughs> yeah, he's cool though. He's gonna be president one does, day. Does he know about that video now? I imagine uh, he must. I don't know. He's he's got to at this point. He's a nice guy. Did you uh, catch up with him later? I mean, I talked to him once after that, but then I could never find him again. He probably changed his name. Maybe he's kicked off his throne. <laughs> yeah, you you uh, exposed him, Chris. Oh, do you want to tell people who might be watching on, on Game Rooms that don't know what we're talking about? Oh, Genesis? Yeah, explain what it is. Oh, he's he's this guy that I met on Second Life, <laughs> and there's a video of him on my YouTube page, but uh, he's he's really good at storytelling <laughs> yeah. and lying. Yeah, his, his, my, favorite, my favorite lie is just like someone's talking about the game Shadow the Hedgehog, and he's just like, hmm, the game was a little too hard. Like, I couldn't, the fucking could, first yeah, thing he, I ever he, hear him say is, I could never quite beat that one. I could That's never just, quite beat that. Yeah, he's talking about Shadow the Hedgehog. He's like, I can never get past it. And then I'm um, like, Shadow the Hedgehog's really easy. And and then he's like, Yeah, well, I skipped past the easy mode and went straight to the most hard difficulty ever. Oh god! Oh, <laughs> Kiss god. your ass goodbye. And I'm oh, like, god. Okay, cool. <laughs> and, you're, and that's the one you were like, This guy is gonna be my friend. Yeah, he's the coolest. This guy I'm gonna get along with. <laughs> I, just, I just like talking to him. He's funny. <laughs> 
That's great. But he's such a fucking liar. <laughs> yeah, it was it was amazing how much of a liar he was. Well, yeah, he was telling stories about like how he got his sword or whatever. Like there was some crazy mythology he was saying. Yeah. And that he was a prince and all this shit. Yeah, he and says he says, This sword is non copy, non trans, and everyone's like, Yeah, but that makes it really easy to lose if you lose it. And he's like, Yeah, well, I asked the shopkeeper if I could have that. <laughs> like, well, then why did you say it? the other thing? <laughs> Fucking crazy. What does bastard. that mean on Second Life? Non copy, non trans. I don't even know if it's real or not. It just means that you you can't like you can't give it to other people. It, it's ID to you and you only. Oh wow. But I don't know if that's true. You I sh- want. The, oh my god. Sorry, Rod. What are you? Oh no. I was gonna say have him on when he plays. That'd be great. Um, <laughs> me and Chris, it. we investigated. There's apparently a new Second Life coming out. Oh, oh yeah, I can't wait. Oh. And it's like gonna be VR. And it's like what? modern day graphics and shit, and like it had applications for. Uh, yeah, um, we signed up for it, but they yeah. didn't get back to and it. Appli- it literally has applications for like uh, be- people to like use it, and I was like, "Well, I have a fucking Vive. I want to try it." Yeah. And uh, I applied, and they fucking they did not respond to me. Yo, oh, respond dude. to us. We'll play. We'll yeah. Okay. It. If any- so Linden so Labs, much- we'll fucking we'll we'll check it out. We promise we won't because I don't think you can stream it or anything yet. You guys no, I just want to so play exposure. it. I just want to try it. I know. I'll make things for it. It'll be fun. <laughs> I will too. I can three D model. Let me play with yeah, it. And I can animate. Let me in. I can do particle <laughs> effects. Fuck. Because they only want people who can contribute. And the, I kept saying, there's like, did you play Second Life? And I was like, what's your, and I was like, yes. What's your account? It's like, I don't fucking know. I tried it once and I made like a little goblin man and ran around. Like, I don't remember. You ready? Yeah, go oh, for there's it. There's John Redcorn at Byron's hey. Redcorn. Oh, there's <laughs> true to name. Yeah. I don't know. I got nothing. <laughs> Really okay. uninspired today. I'll, I'll go here. All right. He's saying, <laughs> "Not my son." <laughs> 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 fucking Chris. <laughs> fucking <clumped laughs> yeah, you go. I, I just did a. a He's an Indian. <laughs> <laughs> That's just an Indian. Racially just, insensitive. Just an Indian. That's a just an Indian. <laughs> it's even worse, Rod. He's not just an Indian. He's his own man. Let's draw fucking Peggy, dude. Peggy. Dude, Peggy's hot. We, we need to speed up the drawings a little bit because Ryan's gonna have to sit through Uh-oh. all these. Oh, yeah, whatever. Yeah. You can fucking deal Just a little bit. I'm Sorry, Ryan. Just a little bit. Okay, Peggy. Peggy you make really good steaks, oh, Ryan. I have a really good idea for Peggy, but like, he does make I don't know steaks. if I can uh, get away with it. Peggy Hill. I need Ryan's uh, his Spot. recipe for uh, that steak he made. I know, it was really it's fucking amazing. <laughs> it's really good. He was so like no big deal about it. He's like, yeah, just you know, sprinkled some salt and he dirt. marinated it in his own shit and stuff. Yeah, he's got great tasting shit. Yeah, he's got a big clit too. <laughs> Spread this clit all over the steak. <laughs> fucking rare, Peggy. Of course, you're gonna draw the fucking scene. You know the mm. scene. You know the scene, Rod. Boggle. No. No <laughs> scene. The one where she made dumb art and they called it hick art and she got sad. The scene where. She on the airplane and she fall off. What? <laughs> yeah. Yeah. That's the last episode. <laughs> no, it's not. She dies. She falls out of a fucking airplane. Oh, yeah. I forgot about that. She did fall out of an airplane. That was like a season finale, right? Yeah. Oh, my God. He goes, oh, my wife fell out of an airplane. Did she have a... Puggy. Did she have like a parachute or what? She failed. Used, she used her minge. Am I wrong to say that like Peggy's like a horrible human being? <laughs> Is she? <laughs> She's like I re- I rewatched it like not too long ago, like maybe like a year and a half, two years ago, and like she's kind of a shitty person. Really? She, she does a lot of stuff that's like, wow. If she was my mom, I would fucking hate her. <laughs> you don't think she has like at least good intentions? No, but she, that's the thing. She has uh she disguises a lot of her uh her intentions. Uh, as good her, her selfish desires as good intentions oh, like like a mom yeah like oh I want to be a I want to be a teacher but uh, I don't have the qualifications so I'm gonna be pretend to be a nun and shit like that like she doesn't care for I don't know I can't even think of all the good examples but I just remember when I was watching it I was like I don't think I like her I think she's actually evil I think she's actually a bad human being and apparently there's a lot of people who agree with me on this they're like yeah Peggy sucks she's She's really a horrible person. It's like when Breaking Bad was out and everyone wanted uh, his wife, like, her head on a platter. Like, oh, yeah. What? Like, super angry. Like, everyone uh, hated Skylar. It was just yeah. because... I, I never watched more, more than one season of it. Oh, no. Well, But, I mean, that's fine. Just go ahead. I, I'm, I'm yeah, going to get around to watching it eventually. I'll just say that I, I, didn't, quite, I, didn't, I didn't quite see the hatred, considering her situation. It's all because of one line she says. Oh. Well, then. 
You know the part I'm talking about where she comes in and she whispers in his ear. You know that part? When she's like, I'm glad you have cancer. <laughs> <laughs> she doesn't that say that. She doesn't say that at all. Have you guys seen Swiss Army Man? I keep needing to. Everyone says it's amazing. I uh, highly recommend it. For some reason, I, I I kept just putting it off. I just thought it looked kind of, I don't know, whatever. But, uh, man, it, it grabs you pretty fast once you start. Yeah. I liked it. Um, and I thought it dragged on a bit too long. Oh, really? Yeah. I mean, I thought it was good. Oh, I thought it was, I thought it was nice. I thought it was, it was so beautifully shot, too. It was unique and cool. Yeah, I really enjoyed it. I never, I'll just say this. Mm. I never felt so emotionally moved by a movie that that had that had that much farting in it <laughs> and i feel like that's that's worth something you know like yeah at least that <laughs> and i love that actor like both daniel of, both, yeah both of them are good but the oh, daniel radcliffe's awesome i forget the other guy's name but he's awesome he was in the there will be blood and like a couple other things yeah i love daniel radcliffe he's a good boy you should come on the show daniel radcliffe come on the show He'd be like Thanks for having me. <laughs> what are, what are we drawing? He seems What's like a really drawing? nice guy. We're going to draw you if you were cool. <laughs> and then spit in his face and go, Harry Potter, Harry Potter. <laughs> <laughs> that would be mean. I like him. Yeah, I love him. Do, uh, I love him. I think he's great. You guys should do Lord of the Rings theme when he's here. Oh, let's get Elijah Wood on. I actually her- saw him at LAX. And oh, really? He, I was well, you're w- practically best friends already. I know. He was at. He walked by me at, LA, at, at LAX, and I was by myself, and everyone had gone. And I was just like... <laughs> Man, uh, I could have uh, just I just didn't want to talk to him because I was like, I don't want to be that guy. Yeah, I saw Jake Gyllenhaal on the street and I, I love Jake Gyllenhaal because he's so like he's he's a serious actor, but he's so like goofy to me. Like, I feel like he should be do, doing comedies. And in either case, I saw him and I was like, oh, I don't know. I, what am I going to do? Walk up to him and be like, hey, yeah. I know your face. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Hey, um, you're Donnie Darko. Bye. You're Donnie Darko. <laughs> You should have gone up to him and just sung all of Mad World and not let him walk past. <laughs> <laughs> just keep like you know that the thing where you you meet a random person at the mall and you can't walk past him. Yeah, back and forward, back and forward, back and forward. Around the familiar faces. Just get out of the way. Run <laughs> out places. Please move. People keep Run doing this. <laughs> in that one scene in Donnie Darko when the rabbit says this, is that in reference to this time parallax? <laughs> Do you like rabbits? You like What's rabbits? your favorite rabbit? I like rabbits. Are you guys just about done? I named him Getting there, please. Jake. I promise it'll be worth it. Yeah. All right. I present to you boys Peggy Hill. <laughs> oh! <Whoa! laughs> that's really good. Yeah, she's going to peg, huh? Uh, he's going to oh, peg like him. He's like, ball. <laughs> that's Sarah, Sarah Palin hot right there. Yeah, she's going she's gonna to peg him. <laughs> like his, no! <laughs> <laughs> All that gum. <laughs> <laughs> okay, here's mine. She's falling out of the airplane. <laughs> no, it's like Bob, Bobby Hill. Don't worry, I, love his I got series. you, ma. I got you. You're trying to catch her with the fucking. Show me yours, Bobby. Okay, here's Peggy saying, "Ay ay ay, si me gusta." <laughs> That's good. She knows the Spanish. She sure do. That reminds me of the episode where she got arrested for kidnapping children <laughs> in Mexico. <laughs> she thought the kid needed help, and she was gonna bring him back to America to give him a better life. But she just kidnapped the kid or something. <laughs> oh no, she it was a kid on a field trip, and she took one of the kids back. Oh my god. Because she thought it was one of her kids from her field trip. That's right. <laughs> Go draw some of Hank's friends. Yeah, Dale. Oh, yeah, yeah. saying Dale. That's right, that's right. Dale's like my favorite character. He's awesome. I love him. I just, the fucking bucket sand. <laughs> I like how serious he is about, you know, just everything he does. That was a that was a thing that, um, that uh, Holly used to say. She was like... The the best way to deal with like reading bad YouTube comments is to read them in Dale Gribble's voice, and then Dan and Aaron said it on Game Grumps, so everyone in the comments is gonna be that's what Dan and Aaron said. Fuck you, no, it was Holly first. <laughs> um, Holly was saying that, and we were all laughing at it, so we just <laughs> started reading YouTube comments like, I don't think Dan and Aaron are friends anymore. <laughs> <laughs> like the funniest shit. God, fucking Dale's just so perfect as he is. I can't really, ah. Uh, Strong. He's like my. He's, he's definitely my favorite character from the show. He's hilarious. I just love. It's just like thank you, John Redcorn. Thank you for looking after my <laughs> wife. 
He's such a fucking idiot. <laughs> like, he doesn't know he's getting cooked for the entire show. It's <laughs> the best thing ever. <laughs> the reason he's funny is because he's a piece of shit that's yeah. oblivious to the horrible shit that's, that's happening to him. Which kind of makes you love him because you're just like, he, he, he can be a piece of shit because he's already got <laughs> terrible things going on. Like, other shows, like, learn badly from that kind of a character where they just try and make all the characters pieces of shit. Yeah. And they always get what they want and shit. Yeah. I hate that. You guys should check out uh, F is for Family. It's pretty. Oh, I love that funny. show. What yeah. Yeah. It's a it's on Bill, Netflix. Bill Burr cartoon on Netflix. Yeah, yeah okay. it's really good. I avoided it because I thought the the art was gross. Yeah, I was like, yeah. it's gonna be. Oh, like does it have that like family kind of yeah, guy exactly. look? Yeah, I. It just looked like oh, it's it's a bunch really of hacky. charming. It's really, super yeah, because yeah. that's like that's put me off a lot of things, and I don't mean this as a like a, a as a dig at fucking Seth MacFarlane, but I'm just kind of sick of like all those shows. Well, yeah, I mean, you know what it, I mean, it, it shows. Shows like that where they don't put a, usually when they don't put a lot of care into the animation, it's all about the writing, mm-hmm. and most of the time writing and is not awesome. So, but but efforts for family, it's fucking yeah, it's tight. it's great. There's a Seth MacFarlane show that's coming out that's basically just a Star Trek parody. I saw and that. Yeah, everyone was like digging on it. I was like, actually, I kind of want to see this because it just looks like Galaxy Quest, and I fucking love Galaxy that, Quest. Dude, that's a great fucking movie. Oh, dude, I just watched it recently. It's like me and Holly's like favorite film is that Starship Troopers and I fucking love Starship Troopers. Oh man, uh, oh, favorite films. Most of my favorite films are all like kind of old. Weird. I don't know if you call. Would you call those weird and obscure now? Like it's weird, right? To think that Galaxy Quest is a really old movie now. It is. It is. Yeah. And fuck yeah, like uh, Alan Rickman's dead. And he's like really young in that movie. Yeah, looking. he's super young. I love. I love the line. Like, um, Thaw's hammer. Nah, you will be. I. I was it. Yeah, I, yeah. You will be avenged. Yeah. yeah. That's the best. Here we go. You ready? Oh, go for it. I'll be in the other room watching Game Grumps. <laughs> oh my God. <laughs> here we go. That's his wife. I it's believe his him. cook on his hat. Okay. Uh, here's mine. I don't know. Oh, my God. <laughs> <laughs> He's getting it all over it's Bobby. Like Slender Man. <laughs> Slender Man <deal. laughs> just saw that. He's explaining something. <laughs> I want that Bobby as like my Skype icon. <laughs> sure, I'll save it. Mine's pretty vanilla. Oh yeah, I'm gonna save mine it's just too. A, no, <laughs> just a nice little clean pic. Aw, nice. you got a little happy cat face. You captured his like, essence. Hi. <laughs> Hello. Hello. <laughs> Show me. Show, who do you draw now? Are we gonna uh, draw that worthless, good-looking cunt of a daughter? Uh, Louis. Oh, Louis. Or should we draw? Oh, she's she's a she's a niece. We should, we right? should draw like two oh, more. Yeah, uh, we should maybe we could draw uh, we could draw Boomhauer or we could draw. Oh, oh what about I fucking like uh, uh Bill? Yeah, Bill. Bill's Bill. Bill. He's good. Bill's great. I like the epi- Holly loved the episode where he had all those pigeons. Mm. <laughs> <laughs> there was an episode where he had a bunch of pigeons. I just remember the episode where he's cutting people's hair and charging too much money for it. Oh yeah, I remember that. I, I like the, the the episode where they discovered he had walrus DNA inside of him. What really? You don't remember that? No. They uncovered a scientific military experiment where they had like <laughs> injected him with walrus DNA so that he uh, they were trying to make a super soldier that could survive in colder climates, and he was the failed experiment. Was this like from Vietnam or something? Or Korea? Yeah, some current like some war he was in. He was like, they they put walrus DNA in him. So it's just like the funniest backstory. Ow! Sorry, Chris. sorry you had to hear that. Don't handle your dick so hard, dude. <laughs> oh my god, if you snapped your boner like that, I've heard that can that happen. Noise. Yeah, I used to. Like, I I told. I think I've told you guys before, but I used to be able to crack my dick in the morning. <laughs> What no, you did it. I did. So no, you did it. I did. I fucking did. How did you crack impossible. your dick? It's not impossible. Do it right now. No, and I, can't, I haven't been able to do it since I was like 18. Did you, you have get a boner? Yeah, you yes. Boner. I woke up with big oh, morning erections, and I'd like grab it and bend it back towards me. Oh no! And it would go. 
<laughs> Wait, no, no. Do you mean like the Chris, the cartilage? Or I don't, I don't, there's, no, there's no cartilage. There's no, there's no bone in there. It's just blood. It's, it's just like blo- a, I don't know what it was. Do you think I it was your like God. the bone and you your would, like you pelvis? Would, you would hear an no audible, idea. audible click. Yes. I can't do it anymore. It sounded like bug zappers slapping together. <laughs> <laughs> Look, Look I swear, savers. I swear on my soul. <laughs> do you swear to everyone in the comments I below swear right to everyone now? In the comments. Wait, we're we leaving this. We're we leaving this in. You, yeah. you could snap your dick. Yes. Okay, leave a comment below if you can snap your dick. Don't, don't try, try it. To don't snap try to dick. snap your dick. Don't. Don't. Don't <laughs> fucking. Just like if it's. Don't do it now. If you've ever done it before without us asking you, then tell us. Guys, but if you don't do it. And I didn't say snap in school, it. I cracked it like, drink a, like, milk. like this. Yeah, but there's no bones. I know. I don't, it doesn't make what? sense. Go to I church. I had to have a full erection. Eat your veggies. I just. I could crack my dick first thing in the morning. That's all I remember. Have you ever, like. Look both ways before crossing the street. <laughs> Here, I'm ready. Crack your dick both ways before crossing I'll, I'll, the I'll street. I'll go first. Here's a fucking guy. <laughs> oh, he kind of did the same oh thing. I love it. <laughs> Is that him after he had the walrus DNA? Because yeah. I did the same thing. <laughs> <laughs> did it work? <laughs> his oh walrus. God. Poor fellow. I like his walrus chest. <laughs> yeah. It's ridiculous. Show me Rod. Well, it's not done yet, but there's a, ka- a kawaii-ish. Aww, I like him. Oh. Bill. He's a cutie. He's a sweetheart. He's having a little heartfelt moment. I Aww. Think. He'll never be young again, though. No. Can't go back. <laughs> nope. That's nah. really nice shading. I'll, I'll show you my tricks. I'll show you my tricks. Look at that. Oh. Oh, you can turn it up and down. Wow. <laughs> oh, you did multiple layers of shading? No, and just then, one. Oh, just one? Yeah. Boom, All right, boom, let's boom. do Boomhauer. Wow, that's how you spell it? Jeez. Let me guess. B O O M H A U H E R. It is B O O M H A U E R. Oh, add an extra thing. Oh! go. It's the worst drawing I've done all day. <laughs> Slender Hauer. <laughs> <laughs> it just appears behind you. <laughs> <laughs> Mine's a Dark Souls boss. <laughs> <laughs> Love it. <laughs> Show me Rod. All right. Well, it's a little rushed, but Show me your cum. Take him. Take him. Pork is that asshole. Home. Yeah, well, I mean, I guess we'll fix that. Mm. <laughs> we'll put a little sensor on there. Put a little porky pig head on that, okay? Put a ham. Okay, and then we're gonna end with <laughs> Hank, huh? Hmm? We're gonna skip that bitch Luann and get straight to Hank. Oh, Luann? Really? We're doing Luann? No, we're said I'm gonna skip her. Oh, good. Go yeah, straight I to don't, Hank. Who fucking cares about Luann? It's not me, that's who. Everyone that's going to be in the comments below saying she was a strong, independent woman who needed to realize she was a mechanic the whole time. <laughs> She's a role model for everyone. Are we ready? Y- yes. Okay. You ready for Hank Rod? <sighs> I don't know, man. I don't know. I take off my hoodie for this. This is getting serious. <sighs> Hank Hill. Hank Hill. More like Spank Jill. <laughs> <laughs> okay, let's go. So, Rod, what's the coolest thing about Hank Hill? <laughs> it's his face. <laughs> it's so plain. You think? He is the most average human. I like... The thing I like about Hank is he's so frank. <laughs> like, he's just so... The thing about Hank is he's so yes, frank. Yes, because it rhymes, that's why. No, he's just like, he takes in the world, and he's very, like, I guess, honest about interpreting it. Mm. <laughs> so whenever there's like weird shit, it's just it's hilarious to see such a boring person's reaction to it. <laughs> Hank reminds me of my dad a lot. Yeah. He's really anxious and doesn't get things. <laughs> but it's he's, he's lovable he's a lovable man. Yeah, there's like this charming naivety to some of the stuff that happens to him. Dumbest joke. 
Okay, show me. All right, it's it's election time, and and they they had a family disagreement. <laughs> <laughs> that boy and right. <laughs> but damn, damn though. There we go. Bernie wasn't even president. Ross was Hillary. <laughs> and I couldn't remember if Hillary had two L's or one, so I just figured Bernie would be easier. <laughs> That's good. There's my. I don't know why. Oh my God. I don't know what happened. To him. He's selling his propane. Oh, What's the walking stick he's got? I don't know. It helps him support his body. <laughs> oh, okay. okay. All right. Yeah. Uh, I did a. Boo! 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 That's good. <laughs> All Whoa, right. Signature, cool. signature Hank Hill noise. So uh, it's beautiful. I guess Thank that you. ends today's uh, Doodle Dudes. Um, Rod, my dear friend oh, Rodrigo. What is your Twitter? Where can people find you? Twitter. Oh, you can YouTube's. find. Thank you, Russ. Well, first of all, thank you for having me. You're it's welcome. Quite fun to draw with you guys. Um, yeah, you can find me on Twitter with Elsid underscore tweets, and then you can look me up on YouTube with. If you type in like Batman eats a hot dog, and then you just click on the channel, like. That's usually the best way to find me. So, yeah. So, or else did 1984 is the actual username. So, can you eat a hot dog as fast as Batman? Uh, I did. Remember? Oh, that's right. You did a live action one. Mm-hmm. Yeah, I, was, I, I think was I was in, there for that. You wasn't? were there for that. You helped. <laughs> what year was that? That was a while back, man. I was visiting. I didn't live here, did I? Yeah, I remember Danny was there for that. Weirdly, and like, oh no, I did live here. Yeah. Well, okay. Weird. Yeah, is, I remember that, this. Over. In, yeah. This is this is like over like six years ago. What the fuck? Yeah, it's been a while. Holy shit! It's so crazy to think about. Wow. It's fucked up. Do you want to reminisce about anything else before we finish? <sighs> That's no, that's that's it. All right, cool. All right, bye everyone. See you next week. Bye. Bye.